what I called harvesting from the kingdom of darkness. What did I say? Harvesting from the kingdom of darkness. What did I say? Harvesting from the kingdom of darkness. Children of God, you must try to understand that there are two major kingdoms that you must have knowledge of. You must have knowledge of this kingdom and how they operate. Things that are in it. Those that are in it. And your own responsibility in them. Please listen to my teaching carefully well. In Matthew, Matthew chapter 12, Jesus was talking something there. Matthew chapter 12, verse 25, Jesus was saying something there. But Jesus knew their thoughts. And he said to them, every kingdom divided against itself is brought to the solution. And every city or house divided against itself shall not, what? Shall not stand. stand. He was able to understand and discover that there is kingdom. Just listen to me carefully well. Because what you don't know of can destroy you. It is possible you have access, you have opportunities, you have connections, you have contact, you have helpers, but the lack of knowledge of these things will make you to suffer over the things that you have. Is somebody hearing me here? I hear you, sir. Even as a citizen of every nation, there are benefits that are attached to your citizenship. Yes. And you not knowing it will make you to live in lack in a place of abundance. Hmm. Just listen to me. I'm trying to establish my message here this morning. There are two major kingdoms that you must have knowledge of. The kingdom of God and the kingdom of darkness. In Matthew chapter 6 verse 9, Jesus was teaching his disciple prayer and he said, In this manner, therefore pray, our Father in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in what? In, in heaven. heaven. Your kingdom. Jesus recognized that the kingdom of God is what? Is here. In Colossians chapter 1, Colossians chapter 1, verse 13. Colossians chapter 1, he has delivered us from the power of what? Of darkness and conveyed us into the kingdom of the son of what? Of his love. Two major kingdoms you must have knowledge of. If you must succeed, you must do well on the surface of this earth. Have basic knowledge of this kingdom. These two kingdoms have strong administrative system in place. One came to give life and the other one came to steal. One came to what? Give life and the other one okay. came to steal. John 10.10. 10. The Satan came to steal, to kill, to kill and to destroy, I have come that I might give you life and you have it what? In More abundantly. One of the kingdoms came to kill, to steal, and to destroy, and the other one have come to what? To give life. That is why you must spiritualize everything that comes your way before you bring physical interpretation to the manifestation of what you see. Oh, Are you hearing me here? Yes, sir. You must spiritualize everything around you. Jesus said to them, though they are in this world, but they are not of this world. And if you are not of this world, that means there's a kingdom you are coming from and you must try to understand that apart from the visible kingdom that we see on this earth, there are other invisible yes, kingdoms. Sir. Can I teach you? Yes, sir. Can I teach you? Teach Apart from the physical kingdoms you see on this earth. See, don't reason the way all that reason because your spiritual capacity can never be compared to a carnal man. Yes. A man that is born of flesh, think fleshly, and the one that is born of the spirit, he has spiritually. Mm -hmm. I feel like preaching now. Go further. Is somebody hearing me? Yes, sir. So when you see people thinking in a different aspect, in a different dimension, people say it's always too spiritual. Spiritual, yes, because it's a spirit. 
If you are a spirit, you think spiritually. And if you are fleshly, you act fleshly. Is somebody hearing me here? So a man who is so carnal will not understand the things of the spirit. And you must try to understand that it's what you have knowledge of that you can assess. Can I say that again? Yes, sir. It is what you have knowledge of that you can what? Can you can assess. assess. It is practically impossible for you to have advantage or assess anything that you do not know of his existence. Mm -hmm. Just follow me. Amen. Let me come down a bit. But follow me. I want to expose you now to certain things so that, do you know that there are spirits that move at night while you are sleeping? Yes, sir. Many of them carry virtue. Many of them carry attack. Many of them carry resources. And I've come to understand if there are powers that hijack the blessings, the expectations, the glory, and the miracles of the children of God, you that is a child of God. Now listen to this. You are not just you. You are who you are in the inside. Are you hearing me? Yes, sir. That's why you see a little child. They say the child is a wish. The child killed the mother. The child killed the father. The child did this. The child caused all manners of atrocity. It's not just the child you see. There's something in the child. And that is why the Bible says, greater is he that is in me. You must understand the capacity and what you carry inside you. What you carry inside you is you. Yes. Please permit my grammar. Amen. Are you hearing me? What you carry inside you is you. You can never do more than who you are in the inside. What you are in the outside is actually telling you who you are in the inside. Yeah. Say, Father. Father. I receive power. I receive power. In the inside. In the inside. To become someone great. To become someone great. In the outside. In the outside. Amen. We are talking of harvesting from the kingdom of what? Of, of darkness. darkness. So, my beloved, what is harvest? Please, I will give spiritual definition and a kind of definition. Are you hearing me? Yes, sir. What is harvest? Harvest is a time and a period of reward. A time and a period of what? Of reward. reward. That means after you have labored, you have worked hard, you have prayed, you have fasted, there's always a time to have, to have a reward of that exercise. Yes. Are you hearing me? Yes, sir. Even the prayer we pray now, there's a time for the prayer to what? To, to manifest. And the reflection or the manifestation is the what? Is the reward. May you receive your reward. Amen. I said you will receive your reward. Amen. The reward of every mother is for the children to grow and pay homage with gifts. Mm -hmm. To take care of them. Yes, sir. That's the reward. It is. May you not have evil children. Amen. May your children not torment you. Amen. May they not harass you. Amen. May your children never make you to shed tears. Amen. They will not allow you to shed tears of sorrow. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Harvest is a time of compensation. It's a time of what? Compensation. compensation. Harvest is a time or a period of gathering crops or farm produce. Let's come down now to earthly meaning. It's a time of what? Gathering what? Crops or what? Farm produce. Some of you, you are going to gather. Amen. After the service, I say you will gather. Amen. What you lost, you will gather. Amen. Every good things you lost, you will gather. Amen. I cannot hear your amen. Amen. What is harvest? Harvest is a time set aside to acquire, achieve reward that is due for you. It's a time to what? Set Set aside to acquire. It is yours. You have to acquire it because it's you. Amen. Every good thing you have been waiting for that you have not been able to get, you acquired Amen. now. Amen. I cannot hear your amen. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. What is harvest? Harvest is a period of possessing the possession of one's expectation. Possessing, possessing possession. your possession. It's a period and a time of possessing one's what? Expectation. We possess it. Can I say this to you? If you are not living up to your standard, something is wrong. If you are laboring and nothing to show, something is wrong. Can I say this to you? Yes, sir. There is no labor without compensation. It is either they fail to compensate you or somebody has took it. Listen to me well. No, no, reward, no labor without what compensation. It is either they fail to pay you or somebody claim it. Are you aware there are people who claim people's money? Yes, sir. Huh? Yes. Are you aware that even this grant 
of 350 and how much they are taking. There are people who are collecting it just for nothing. Yes. Hello? Hi. Are you aware there are people who are collecting it? Yes. Are, are you aware there are people who are dead? Others are collecting their salary? Yes. So, there are people who labor, others are what? Are eating. And the Bible says you will not plant for another man to what? To harvest. Neither will you build for another man what? To dwell. So, it is possible for somebody to be laboring without what? Harvesting. Not the harvest never came. There are kingdoms, there are personalities, and there are strong men that are in charge of what you labor for. Can I say this to you? Yes, you do business with people, and the person never paid you. Even the person is making trouble with you. Sometimes it might be that the man have the intention of paying you, but power entered him not to what? Not to pay. Amen. Let's follow my teaching because it will help you. Amen. Say, I am here. I am here. Haven't know what harvest means. What is kingdom? Kingdom is a country, a state, or a territory ruled by a king or a queen. And you must try to understand we have both the evil queen and what? Godly queen. If the wicked rule, what happens? The righteous will what? We suffer. suffer. When the wicked rules, the wicked rules. The righteous what? We suffer. And it came to a time, the Bible said, three wise men saw the stars of Jesus that was born in Bethlehem and they followed the star. Now listen to this. They were tracing the star to go and honor a child that is what? That is born. But here came a strong man who had the knowledge and the interpretation, the meaning of the star that they saw and he stood. For them not to locate what? The child. Are you aware that there are people that God has sent to you to help you, to elevate you, to connect you, to lift you up, to bless you? Yet, forces hold them not to get to you. And Apostle Paul said, we wanted to come to you, but devil hindered us. Can I say this to somebody? Yes, Everyone that is hindering the helpers of your destiny, anyone that is discouraging men and women that God has sent to you to transform your life, transform your business, transform your career, and shine light upon your life in the name of Jesus, I harass them. Amen. 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 In the name of Jesus. Amen. Spirit of God. Amen. Let me teach you. A kingdom is a realm ruled by supreme authority. A kingdom is a what? Realm ruled by what? Supreme authority. Friends, you must understand how this kingdom rules and the treasures that lie in them. No kingdom is void of resources. Amen. Please listen. Don't be, dis don't be distracted. I'm teaching. I want to take you a bit deep now. Amen. No kingdom is void of what? Resources. Yes. No kingdom is void. Can I say, is Satan rich? Yes. I want to prove to you. Is Satan rich? Yes. yes he and he said to Jesus, all the glory of this world has been given unto me. If only you can bow, I will give that to what? To, to you. you. How dare you say Satan is poor? Satan is Satan poor? No. Does Satan have source of wealth? No. How is he getting it? Stealing. What is the Bible saying? He came to what? To steal, to kill, and to what? To destroy. Who is Satan stealing from? Us. Yes. Can I preach here? Yes, sir. Can I preach here? Yes, sir. Are you ready to take back? Yes. You will take your own bed. Amen. I said by fire by force. Amen. You are taking your own bed. Amen. You will take it back. 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 Amen. By fire. Amen. You will take your own. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. When Jesus was saying, thy kingdom come on earth as it is in heaven. Jesus was actually making references of the benefits of heaven coming to, the, to, coming to earth for the people of this earth to enjoy it as God and his, and his angels are enjoying what? In heaven. Did you hear what I said? Yes, sir. When, can, listen to this. An American ambassador... To South Africa, we have certain benefits and things that he enjoy, like those ministers in America. 
though it's in South Africa. Yes, sir. Are you hearing me? Yes. You will see that most of the things they use in their embassy say they brought it from America. Now I'm trying to enlighten your mind. Yes, sir. Is somebody hearing me here? Yes, sir. Most, you can see that most of their cutleries, most of their things, they brought them here. Mm. Are, you, are you aware that most of these embassies of the world in this country, there are things they don't buy here? Yes. As they are coming, they come with those things. Mm. They bring them here. Jesus was actually saying, your kingdom come on earth as it is in heaven. Meaning the people you send to this world should also enjoy the things that the, 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 the personalities are also enjoying what? In, in heaven. heaven. Amen. Trying to enlighten your mind so that you can understand it. Hmm. Number one thing you must, you must enjoy as a child of God is security. Hmm. Amen. Security. Amen. That is where the Bible says touch not my anointed, and do my prophet Lord no, no harm. harm. Uh, if you understand, I have basic knowledge of the word of God. There are people who will shoot you out of their first son will die. Mm, amen. There are people who will try to use muti against you. If God pity for them, you will just see that breakthrough will happen. Mm. What is that breakthrough? Compensation. Yeah. Where is the compensation coming from? What they have labeled. Because the Bible makes me to understand when the Philistines took the Ark Covenant of God and they put it on the altar of Dagon. They woke up in the morning, the head was removed. Yes. God is the head. Mm -hmm. You can't put him where I do is. Yes. Amen. <laughs> they erected him again. They came in the morning, their hands are open. Removed. Hands removed. You don't touch God. No eyes see at him and what? And, and leave. leave. When they saw trouble, they, were, they now came together and said, what offering shall we give to accompany the Ark Covenant of God and return it? So now listen to these Christians. Anytime people plan evil against you, they are supposed to pay. Yeah. These are source of un, un, in fact, unexplainable miracle. Mm. The miracle will just happen, boom. Breakthrough can just happen, boom. Door can just open. Now, sometimes it's good for you to have enemies. What did God tell Abraham in Genesis chapter 12? He said, whoever that blesses you shall be blessed. Whoever that curses you. That curse might not be you are a foolish man. You are a foolish woman. A curse can be in a place of conspiracy. Mm, yes. Can I preach here? Yes, sir. A curse can be in a place of bad wishes. Mm. Somebody wish you bad, God said, for this you have done, I take the next breakthrough, coming to your way, and I give to my daughter. Amen. So shall it be. Amen. <laughs> Is somebody hearing me here? Yes, sir. Is somebody hearing me here? Yes, sir. So sometimes, it's also good for you to have enemies. Because there are enemies that project miracles. Yeah. There are enemies that bring breakthrough. There are enemies that bring open door. Everyone who have decided to become your enemy, they shall be your source of income. Amen. I cannot hear your amen here. Amen. I cannot hear your amen here. Amen. I cannot hear your amen here. Amen. One of the first things you must enjoy is what? Security. I will give my angels charge over you. It's Psalm 91 verse 11. I will what? Give my, why is God giving angels to you? That you will not dash your foot against what? A stove. First one is what? Security. Number two is for you to be a king and a queen on earth. If the kingdom come, have you ever seen a, 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 a good kingdom and their king is suffering? Huh? No. Have you ever seen anyone from royal home suffering? No, sir. In fact, have you ever seen anyone from royal home traveling out of the kingdom to go and hustle? No. Huh? No, sir. Why most people travel is because they are looking for greener pasture. Yes. Yeah, for real. If you are doing well, you won't like to travel. There is no place like home. Is it true? Is it true? No place like home. Let me teach you where here. Forget how you will pretend. If you, uh, the poorest country of the world, there are millionaires there. Yes. And if you tell them travel, they say no, I'm fine. Is it true? Yes, sir. Do you expect an an Australian, an American that is doing well to come to one of these deserts in Africa? No. If those ones are coming. Let's watch them where. They are not just coming. They are coming to steal. <laughs> no, for you. They are not just coming for, for pleasure. No. They are either they are coming for resources, or they are coming for adventure, mm -hmm. or they are coming for evil. Yeah. They will not leave that place and come here to suffer. Mm -hmm. One 
of the things you will enjoy when the kingdom of God comes is for you to enjoy the privileges of royalty. The privileges of what? Of, of royalty. royalty. Another thing you will enjoy when kingdom comes is to be supplied. Mm -hmm. Amen. My God shall supply you oh, all oh, your needs according to his riches in glory in what? In it Christ has. Jesus. Ephesians chapter 4 verse 19. Mm. So, if you are not enjoying any of these things at all, it simply means God actually provided, but they were hijacked. It simply means, if I were you as I'm preaching, I will be angry. In fact, I will be prepared to go and do spiritual toy toy. Bring that kingdom down. Bring that altar down. Let the wish daughter die. Amen. Are you hearing me here? Yes, sir. I want to feel your presence here. Yeah. Are, you, are you hearing me here? I hear you, sir. If I were you, I, I have to be angry now. Yes. If you are not living as a king on earth, First Peter chapter 2, verse 9. What is the Bible saying there? Now, let's read the text so that you understand what I'm saying. You're supposed to live as a king. You don't eat remnants. And the woman, Jesus said to the woman, the bread that is made for the children shall not be given to dogs. And the woman said, even the crumbs that fall from the table. You, you, you didn't hear. I hear you, sir. He said, the bread that is made for the children, meaning you are not supposed to suffer. You are not supposed to eat remnant. You are supposed to eat on the table like your father. Your father is a king and you are supposed to live as a what? As a king. Amen. See, I hear. I hear. But you are a chosen generation, a royal priesthood, a holy nation, his own special people. Do you hear that? Yes. Never you commonize any scripture. Mm. You say you are what? You are what? Special. special. Say I am special. I am special. Say my friend. My friend. Don't look down on me. Don't look down I'm on so me. Special. I'm so special. I'm so special. Say friend. Friend. I am special. I am special. I am chosen. I am chosen. I'm a royal priesthood. I'm royal priesthood. A peculiar one. A peculiar one. I am a nation. I'm a nation. That God loves. That God loves. Amen. That he may proclaim the praises of him who has called him out of what? Darkness. Darkness into what? His Marvelous darkness. light. Now compare yourself to the people in darkness. Though they will go to hell, but some of them are enjoying. Yes. Let's see the truth. Mm, Is it true? It's true, sir. Is it true? It's true. No, 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 no. no. It's very Though true, they might sir. go to hell fire, mm. but many of them are enjoying. Yes. My people perish. For know. the lack of what? Of knowledge. No, let, see, don't emotionalize scripture or, 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 or should I say, doctrinize it. Hmm. I say, no, 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 they are not doing well. No, there are people who are not of God, they are doing well. Yes. No, let's face the truth. Let's face they are driving good car, hmm. living good house, eating good meals, travel around the world, having good holidays. No, for you. Yes, it's true. Though the Bible says, do not admire the wealth of the righteous in Psalm 27. Mm. See, in a short while, they shall be what? Shall be Cut off. off. But I'm telling you that many of them understand the administrative system of their kingdom. That is why they have harvest. Yes. Understand the kingdom you are. When you understand this kingdom, you will know that there is abundance in what? In the kingdom. Amen. It says silver and gold are what? Am I? Now, knowing that they belong to God, you must have the knowledge of harvesting it from him. Mm. Knowing it is not enough. Having the knowledge that those things are there are not just enough. You must also have the knowledge of taking it. Now, many of you have the knowledge that Satan has stolen from you. Is it true? Yes. You have the knowledge that Satan has taken from you. Yes. But you must also have the knowledge of taking back. Amen. What matter is taking back? Yes, not sir. knowing that he has taken it from you. Amen. Say, I take it. I take it. By fire. By fire. By force. By force. Say, I take it. I take it. By fire. By fire. By force. By force. Amen. Say, I'm here. I'm here. Jesus recognized a personality called a strong man in Matthew chapter 12. Matthew chapter 12, verse 29. What is the Bible saying? Oh, how can one enter a strong man's house? And planter his goods unless yeah. he first binds the strong man. Unless it's what? He binds the strong man. Who is this strong man? Strong man is a personality, strong, empowered, guided, in position of men's possession potentials, possessions, certificates, weathering, khakis, husky, good health, anything you can think of. Mm. 
Can I say this to you? Yes, sir. Why is he protected? Because he's in possession of value. Oh. Have you ever seen a nonentity, a wanderer in the journey of life having security? Before you see a man being protected with security, the man must be a man of value. Yes, sir. A woman of caliber, mm. man of substance. Mm. You can't just see a man who have nothing, who is even struggling to pay rent, struggling to eat. He says having bodyguards. Before you have bodyguards that guide you, you have something that you are what you, you are protected. protected. Yeah. For this man, they call a strong man to be to be highly protected, highly secured. Even Jesus make analysis of how strong he is. That you cannot just enter his house and take his goods unless you want you bind him and. I'm must make you to understand that before the enemy came and stole from you, there was something they did to you. Yes, they found me. Yeah. Are you getting my get yes, me? Sir. Are you getting me here? Get there was something they what they, they did to you. Now, for the enemy to be able to steal from you, they have knowledge of who you are. About shatter. Is somebody hearing me? Yes. For the enemy to be able to steal from you, they have knowledge of who you are. They had a loophole. They had an opportunity, and they utilize it. Christians never you neglect any opportunity of recovery. Babe. Never you neglect any opportunity of what of it recovery. Any time opportunity present itself to you, can I say this to you? Yes, can I say this to you? Yes, when preparation meets opportunity, there will be manifestation. Yes. Any time you have opportunity, never you procrastinate and say just tomorrow. Can I say this to you? The angels that come today might not be the same angel that will come tomorrow. And you must try to understand that every angel has their responsibility. Can I say this to somebody? The angels that came yesterday might come for those who are looking for the fruit of the womb. Might come for those who are looking for job. But the angels that is here today might be the angels that have come to settle. Authors that have refused to let the people of God go. Authors that said no. That we have an agreement with their father. That we will only allow them to prosper in our own choices. Can I say this to you? Yes, they lie. Who is he that said to you? And it come to pass uh, when Jehovah Rapha, Jehovah Nehi, Jehovah Shema, Jehovah Teskelo, Jehovah Beniza. Can I say this to someone here? I am mandated to speak to any life here. No hey. one that say no over the years of God in your life die. Amen. I said they die. 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 In the name. Jesus, the strong man, let me go. The strong man, release my protection, release my certificate, release my promotion, release my success, release my breakthrough, release my good health. The strong man, release me. The strong man, release me. Strong man, release me. Sit down, let me teach you. Today is today. Amen. Sons of God. Is there anything to harvest in the kingdom of darkness? Yes. yes. In Daniel chapter 10, verse 10 to 12. Is there anything to harvest? Yes. Can I say this to you? Yes, sir. I have told you time and over time, if they have the air country to enter your house, enter your life, vandalize, steal, and scatter, you can enter their own. Mm. Amen. Are you hearing me? Yes, sir. You can swear enter their home. Are you hearing me? I hear you, sir. Bombard their kingdom. Amen. Bombard their altar. And the prophet prophesied. I said, by this time tomorrow, a bale of flour shall be sold for a shekel. And a man came and rebuked the word of the prophet. And said, even though the windows of heaven are open, can this thing ever be? And the prophet said, how dare, how dare you con con contest with the mandate of heaven? And God said something through the prophet. He said, you will see it, but you will not be a partaker. Can I say this to somebody? Yes, Anytime God wants to restore a man, if there's anything that needs to die for his war to come to manifestation, that in die. Anytime God wants to restore a nation, if there's any contention, any contest, contender against that nation, God don't mind to kill the whole, kill the whole nation. Can I say this to you? Never you 
underestimate the judgmental move of God. God has destroyed the whole world before. If you feel that God cannot destroy a nation, we are just joking. God has destroyed the whole world in the time past and left the family of Noah. God swallowed the whole nation. He swallowed the whole nation with water. Can I say this to you? Yes, if you taste God to kill the whole community for you to prosper, I said to death, let it die. 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 Without this power, they don't know who this God is. Yeah. God, He walks in the affairs of men. God. God is too big. There are times that God expects you to deal with these powers. He's too big to invite him. God, anytime God is coming, he announced his arrival. Mm. He told Moses, he said, prepare your people for I am coming on this mountain, Mount Sinai. He said, but guide them so that they will not gaze mm. and look at me. Or else they what? They perish. Not to touch, but to look. Mm. Yeah. How dare you? And he said to Moses, no one see it, God, and what? And live. There are powers that you see you, they confess. Amen. Do you know why? You are the image of, of God. God. Mm. Say, I know who I am. I know who I am. You are the image of what? Of, of God. God. Is there anything to harvest in the kingdom of darkness? Yeah. Plenty. Somebody say plenty. Plenty. Somebody say plenty. Plenty. Why? Because he came to steal. Now, in the school of recovery, emotion should not be attached. Whether it's your own or not your own, carry. Amen. Oh, God, you didn't hear me. I hear you. I said, in the school and the atmosphere of recovery, you don't say, this is not my own. It doesn't concern you. If you can take it, it becomes yours on earth. If it's a car, carry. If it is money, carry. If it is husky, carry. If it is children, carry. If it is donation, carry. Can I say this to somebody? the magic of heaven. I see you entering their kingdom. Amen. I say, I see you entering their kingdom Amen. to recover, Amen. to take back, Amen. to recover, Amen. to take back, Amen. to recover, Amen. to take back. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. can I say this to you? Yes, In every family, there's a prophecy. Yes, Is somebody hearing me yes, here? In every family, there's a prophecy. Yes, I have come to understand that sometimes even a wish doctor can prophesy good. Is somebody hearing me here? I have come to understand that sometimes a wish doctor can prophesy good and say in the family of John, a child will call that a child will be born and that child will be greater and will be massively richer. Can I say this to you? When there's a prophecy, there's a manifestation. Is somebody hearing me here? Say I am that prophecy. 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 Amen. Can I say this to you? Yes, sir. When the prophet prophesied, he said, by this time tomorrow, a bell of flowers shall be sold for a shaker. The prophecy was not for everybody. The Prophecy manifestation fell on the cripple. It was not fair. it was not meant for everyone that is eligible that was complete. But prophecy fell on the deformed. Amen. You didn't hear me. I hear you, sir. The prophecy fell on the deformed. It fell on people that men never thought of. that through these four people, revival can come upon the nation. There are people who look on you, they look down on you, they don't know that you are carrying the prophecy. Is somebody hearing me here? The enemy might have stolen her, but there's a provision for recovery. Is somebody, is somebody hearing me here? And the Bible said, came to a time that these two lepers, they stand at the gate of Samaria. They said, ah, if we stay here, hunger will kill us. If we go inside, the army of Syria might kill us. And they said, it's better we enter. If we die, we die. They never knew that there's a spirit of prophecy moving around their head. The spirit of prophecy is a force. It pushes a man to a pool of manifestation. There was a spirit upon them. They were not the one talking. There was a spirit inside them. Prophecy push a man. Prophecy makes you to be uncomfortable. Prophecy is a spiritual pregnancy.
ask me. Hey. Is somebody hearing me here? Yes, sir. The vision is an appointed time. He said, do it, that word for it. For it shall surely come to pass. I can't just put to somebody here. Yes, because there's a prophecy upon your head. Hey. Your father might have failed. Yes, sir. Your mother might have failed. Yes, sir. Your sisters might have failed. Yes, sir. Your uncles might have failed. Yes, sir. Your brothers might have failed. Yes, can I say this to you? Yes, they are not the one carrying the prophecy. Oh, yes. Can I say this to you? Yes, a mother carrying prophecy. Hey. A mother carrying prophecy. Hey. Don't die anyhow. Hey. Don't die anyhow. Hey. He said the word that I sent forth hey. will not come back to me for that. Hey. God cannot be seen as a liar. Who hey. will manifest his word? Hey. He's the one that carried the prophecy. Hey. Die before the manifestation. Hey. Hey. Can I say to somebody here? Yes. There's a prophecy on your head Amen. that needs to manifest. Amen. You set and give way. You set and give way. Yes, you devil give way. Amen. I am a child of prophecy. Yes, you demon give way. Amen. Release me by fire. Oh, yes. Release me by force. Amen. I am carrying prophecy. Amen. Don't delay God. Yes. Don't delay God. Amen. God is waiting Amen. for the manifestation Amen. of the prophecy I carry. Amen. Hallelujah. I carry prophecy. Amen. I see the manifestation. Yes. You carry prophecy. Amen. You are not like others. Yes. You are not like others. Amen. You are not like others. Amen. You are not like others. Amen. There's prophecy on my head. Amen. There's prophecy on my head. Amen. I am born to manifest. Amen. I am born to correct error. Amen. By this time tomorrow, yes. a pale of flower Amen. shall be so for a shaker. Yes. That prophecy was resting on the man. Yes. I prophesy what nobody could achieve Amen. in your family. Let me teach you. I'm closing here. Fire burn them. Fire burn them. Amen. You can't carry prophecy and live anyhow. Amen. A man that carry prophecy carry God. You carry prophecy, you carry God. Ah, you know who you are? Lepers, lepers, people who couldn't walk. We are carrying prophecy. People who couldn't walk with the one carrying prophecy. People that the nation has condemned, family have condemned, friends have condemned, brothers have condemned, sisters have condemned. They looked down on them, but they couldn't see. They, they never saw that this one, he might be a beggar. He might be a beggar. He can be squatting. He might not have clothes to wear. He might not have a good name. But he carried prophecy. Say, my brother, I carry prophecy. Say, my sister, I carry prophecy. Say, I carry prophecy. Say, I carry prophecy. Say, I carry prophecy. Say, you kingdom of darkness, you can't stop me. Say, you kingdom of darkness, you can't stop me. You can't stop me. You can't stop me. Endless expectations of the righteous. Can I say this to somebody? I might have been delayed, but my season has come. My season has come. My season has come. My prophecy is not. My prophecy is not. My prophecy is not. I know who I am now. I'm not just a nobody. I carry prophecy. Amen. You set up. Yes. I rebuke you. Amen. Over my life. Amen. You set up. I rebuke you. Amen. Over my business. Amen. You set up. I rebuke you. Amen. Over my career. Amen. You set up. I rebuke you. Amen. Over my business. Amen. I carry prophecy. Amen. Sit down one minute before I close. <laughs> Fire burn them. Huh? Fire burn that devil. Fire burn them. <laughs> you will recover. Amen. Today is today. Amen. <laughs> I, I provoke that kingdom. Amen. <laughs> I provoke that. Amen. <laughs> 
I need to finish my message. I provoked her. I provoked her. Amen. You are too big to be small. Amen. You, you are too big. Ah. It took God time to create you. Amen. I must finish this message. Amen. It took God time to create you. And he said to them, in verse 28, he said, go and multiply. He said, increase. Have dominion over the things of the earth. He said, subdue all nation. Say, I subdue. I subdue. Sit down, let me preach. <laughs> we have a lot to preach, but I'm closing. I have a lot to preach. Is there anything to harvest in the kingdom of darkness? Yes. The people say, in a twin light, in the dark, the armies were there with their armies. See, understand the force of words. The force of words are heavier than the force of bullets. Yeah. Are you not aware that the one who carry God can kill himself? Yes. The force of the mouth is stronger than the force of gun. Understand that. Don't be an any hard Christian. Be a Christian that Christians even fear. Shall I say it again? Yes, sir. Be a Christian that Christians even fear. Amen. If Christians can fear you, what of a witch? Mm. Be a Christian that Christians fear. You enter a place, ah, that man is full of fire. Don't talk about him. Don't talk about him. Don't talk about him. Go send a prophet to better to destroy an altar. Now here comes a wicked king to lay hand on the prophet. What happened? They hang with her. Touch not my anointed and do my prophet. Uh -huh. wow. See, I hear. I hear. Now listen. Satan do not understand that God remain God. You know, sometimes people would think that, you know, you know why people start insulting you? They told that they know all of you. Yeah. <laughs> mm. They don't know that you have spiritual reservoir. Hey. <laughs> the undertaker said to Cain, Cain, I taught you how to fight wrestling, but unfortunately, I didn't show you everything. Mm. Because I know a day will come when you will try to stand me and fight me. Satan taught. See, can I say this to you? Yes. Satan was the closest angel to God. Satan was the one that God took to the Garden of Eden. Go and study the Bible. Time will not permit me. Satan was the one who knew everything about God. And he thought he knew all. Can I say this to you? Listen as I close here. Anytime you carry prophecy, you become God's own entity that is valued, that demands protection, yes. so that God will not be seen as a liar. Yes, I hear you, sir. Amen. Because if that prophecy do not come to pass, people will not believe him. Yes, that's true. He is not a man that lies, neither the son of man that repents. Repent. So, if you carry prophecy, let me give you a spiritual pee when you are sick and people tell you you are going to die. Anytime they come to you and they say to you, you are going to die, say, Father, I know you cannot lie. Remember, your prophecy has not come yes, to pass. Yes, amen. Yes. Are you hearing me? Yes, sir. Anytime death treating you, Satan treating you, keep reminding God, Father, you are not a man that what? That lie. Right. Remember, you promise this. Since I was born now, I am, I am old. I have never seen the righteous forsaken. Neither see his sons beg for bread. From today, you will never beg again. Amen. Did you hear what I said? Yes, sir. Is that prayer for you? Yes, sir. I said from today, miraculously, there will be a supply that will break that stronghold of begging. Amen. I, I, you didn't hear me. I hear you, sir. I said from today, Amen. there will be a supernatural open door Amen. that will end your begging. Amen. That will end your suffering. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Now, fire burn them. Amen. You will recover. Amen. Uh, did you believe? I believe. You believe? Yes, sir. I said you will recover. Amen. It was not your fault that they stole from you. It was as a result of what you don't know. I hear you, sir. If a man who have value in the house knew that thief will come, he would have put in measures yes. of security. That's true, sir. Is it not true? It's true. You were void of security. Yes. That was why they took advantage. Mm. But now, you know who you are. Yeah, and Jesus said to them, an enemy has done this and went his way. Meaning he was not created in that manner. Mm. 
He was not created the word in that one. Say, Satan. Satan. Release it. Release it. Or you die. Or you die. Amen. Can I prove this, this to you? Yes, sir. That Satan also need help. Mm. In Job chapter 1, when you read from verse 6 down, the Bible says, The sons of man gathered, and Satan also, also came, okay. and God asked Satan, Satan, where are you coming That's from? Wrong. Says, walking about, then, looking for who to what? To, to devour. Mm. And he placed a request. So, a platform, a request, is a sign of inefficiency. Yeah. Mm, I hear you, sir. Did you hear what I said? Yes, sir. It's a, it's a what? A, a platform of inefficiency. It, it simply means you are in lack. Yes. Before you ask. Yes. That is why God don't ask. Mm. Have you ever seen where God asks? No, sir. God don't ask because it's all sufficient God. So, Satan is also disadvantaged. Now, use the area he's weak to attack him. Did you hear what I said? Yes, sir. You see, now, if a child eats from every home, it can easily be poisoned. Yes. Is it not true? Yes, sir. Is it true? Yes, sir. Now, you can actually give a message to your enemy and ambush them. Since it's a force that walk about looking for who to devour, his agents are like their father. That is why they can move from one native daughter to the other native daughter trying to destroy you. Now send them a message and command the forces of heaven to kill them. Amen. <laughs> Let me not go far. Because I want to close. They saw your weakness. That was why they used it. Now look for their weakness and use it. Amen. Look for their weakness and what? And use, and use it. it. Yes, Daniel chapter 10, verse 10 to 12. Daniel chapter 10. Suddenly a hand touched me, yes. which made me tremble on my knees and on the palms of my hands. Yes. And he said to me, And he said to me, Oh Daniel, oh Daniel, men greatly loved. Men greatly loved. Understand the words that I speak to you and stand upright. Oh, understand the words that I speak to you and stand upright. Upright, yes. For I have now been sent to you. I have now been sent to you. While he was speaking this way to me, yes. I, I stood trembling. Uh -huh. Then he said to me, Then he said to me, Do not fear, Daniel. Do not fear, Daniel. For from the first from day, the first day you humble yourself and set your heart on prayer. Mm. God answered you. And I, angel Gabriel, carry your own blessing, and the prince of Pesha will stood me for good 21 days. Now, can I ask you a question here? Yes, sir. Who knows how many angels God has sent to you hey. and they are somewhere? Hey. Because anytime you pray, make it God send you an angel. Yeah. Because the angels of God, they can't be, if I, you can't number them. Yes. They can't even finish. Mm. As much as Jesus asked the demon possessed person, how many are you and the demons? We say, we are what? We are legion. legion. So if they will have legions of demons in one person, what of God placing one million angels on one man? Mm. I don't know. See, when you study the scripture, now emphasize it personally and manifest it on your own. Yes, sir. Are you understanding me? Yes, sir. Satan bombard one person with over 2,000 demons. Now, don't you think that God can put, and can I say this to you? No man on earth have up to 2,000 security at a go in his move. Have you ever seen it? No, sir. 2,000 security? No. No? But Satan placed 2,000 demons on one man. Mm. So if Satan have knowledge of placing over 2,000 demons of, that of a man, that means God can place over 10 million angels on you. Amen. If you know who you are, from today, people plan against you, they will die. Amen. I will give my angels, not angel, mind the wall. Yes. In Psalm 91 verse 11, he never said angel. He said what? Angels. angels. Say, I'm not ordinary. I'm not ordinary. Hey, say, I carry angels around me. I carry angels around me. Amen. From the day you set your heart on prayer, I answered you. I was sent to you, but the prince of Pesha, what happened? They withstood me and kept me. Imagine, they kept the angel of God. Say, my father. My father. I refuse. I refuse. To accept. To accept. Yege, yege angels. Yege, yege Say, angels. Father. Father. Release. Release. Violent angels. Violent angels. For me. For me. Amen. <laughs> okay, hey. now, as I close. Yeah. Are you aware that it was an angel that bailed an angel? Hmm. 
Why is it that that angel was not sent? Such an angel can be sent. Now, the platform you operate determines the kind of spirit angels that guide you. Hey. If you are in a violent ministry, mm. huh, they can't give you gentle angels. No. There are angels of deliverance. There are angels of blessing. Angels that come to carry glory. Angels that open service. There are angels that are after demons. Mm. These are red beret angels. Yeah. They catch you, they kill you. Mm. English, they don't hear. Yeah. French, they don't hear. No. You are speaking. In fact, it's like God created and like deaf and dumb. Mm. Who wants to go? Say go! Mm. That they is go. all. Yeah. God is releasing that angel over Amen. your Amen. I say, you shall find them dead. Amen. Your enemy shall die. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Your level of oppression determines the level of security in your place. You cannot compare the presidential security to councillor security. Never. <laughs> is, it, is it the same? No, sir. It's not the same. It's not about your size, age. Yes. It's about your mission, your message, and your mandate. Three M. Mission, message, and what? Okay. Mandate. mandate. Mm. So we are not the same. Never. You can see her small. No, it's not her age. Yes. It's her mission, message, and what? And a mandate. Yes. What she carry? Your value determines your security. Amen. There are people that carry message. Uh, <laughs> you don't understand. There are people that what? Carry message. That, when I say message, can be value. Yes. Can be deliverance. Mm. Can be revelation. Yes. Can be rema. Can be, it can be a daughter, a child that carry a spirit of liberation night. Amen. And God said to the family of Mona, he said, this one, this one that you are carrying, is not an ordinary child like others. Mama, don't drink any hot wine. Na neither allow blade to what? To, to touch it. Parents, hear me and hear me well. All your children are not the same. Yes. Try to discover the one that carry the message and the mandate. I hear you Discover that. the one that carry the message and what the mandate, and prayerfully follow this child. All that children may not have attack, but that that child is a target. Yeah, amen. Watch most of those children from their infancy; they are always sick. Sometimes the devil can even enter and understand his behavior. You know so well that this child. It's a child that God wants to use. Mm. But devil will fight this child, frustrate this child, make this child to... If I don't want to turn this child to be a, a wayward child. Yes. When you don't put your eyes on that child, Satan can win over that child. Mm -hmm. But I pray for you. I receive. None of your children will be useless. Amen. I, I cannot hear your amen here. Amen. I cannot hear your amen here. Amen. In verse 12, then he sent me. Do not hear, Dana. For from the first day that you set your heart to understand and to humble yourself before your God, your words were hard, and I have come because of your what? Of your your words. words. Read down. But the prince of the kingdom of Pesha oh, the do prince to me of the, of days. the prince of the kingdom of Pesha withstood me for how many days? 21. And this man was still praying a word and fasting. Mm. Now listen to this. Lesson to learn as I close. There are delayed, prolonged affliction. Yes. Don't say this is trial of okay. faith. Mm. There are things that Satan is in charge. Yeah, I hear you. Also. If your affliction prolonged to a level now, you are having the tendency of going to take power where there's no power. And he said, he will not allow you to be tempted beyond. Mm. Amen. He will not allow you to what? To be tainted beyond. There are people who said, we are waiting upon the Lord. Meanwhile, they are wasting with the devil. They are not waiting upon the Lord anymore. They are what? They are wasting with the devil. For good 21 days. Satan heard it. Not up to one month. But can I say this to you? Yes, sir. With all humility and hope on it. There are some of you now who have been suffering for years. Yes. Not days. That's true. What did I say? Yes. yes. Not days. Not days. Yes. For I know the thought that I think towards you. There are people who have been suffering for years. Today we end it. Amen. Uh, you didn't hear me? Amen. I said today we end it. Amen. We stood me for 21 days and behold, Michael, one of the chief prince, came to help me for I have been left alone there with the kings. <laughs> they even kept him. 
they kept him. They didn't touch him because they are not after him. They are after the person that is carrying his blessing. They are not after him at all. They are not after this person. They can. How many kings? Kings. Many kings. They were there. These are spiritual personality, spiritual authority. These are strong men of the city, yeah. strong men of the nation. Every strong man in this city, in this nation, in the country you come from, in the community you are from, the village you are from, and they gather together, take cancer against you, not to succeed today. God kill all of them. Amen. I, I cannot hear your amen here. Amen. I said, God kill all of them. Amen. I said, God kill all of them. Amen. I said, God kill all of them. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Is there anything to harvest in the kingdom of darkness? Yes. yes. Isaiah chapter 45, verse 1 to 3. There's something to harvest. Anytime God make mention of something, they are quite remarkable that must be meditated upon for manifestation. Mm. Can I teach you here? Yes, sir. I'm closing here. Just give me extra five minutes, five to ten minutes. I'm gone. I'm done. Yes? That says the Lord to his anointed to say. That says the Lord. To his anointed to Cyprus, whose right hand I have what I, I have, have held. held. Say, my father. My father. Hold my hand. Hold my hand. And lift me up. And lift me up. Amen. Mm. Mm. Read it. Yes. To subdue nations before him. To subdue. When God empower you, you subdue. Amen. You take to dominion authority. You possess. And he said, wherever the soul of Don't the fool shall trip upon, you shall what? You, you shall, shall possess. possess. Can I pray for you? Yes, sir. In that place, you do your business. Yes. Where you go to work. Amen. Where you are searching for Amen. job. As you enter there from tomorrow, take over. Amen. By the mandate of the word of God, Amen. take over. Amen. Uh -huh. Take over. Amen. The word of God cannot lie. Take Amen. over. Amen. Take over. Amen. Possess the environment. Amen. Possess the resources. Amen. Possess the opportunity. Amen. Possess the connection. Amen. Possess the contact. Amen. In the name. Amen. Yes. And lose the armor of kings mm -hmm. to open before him the double doors. To so open before him double what? Double oh. doors so that the gate will not what? Will, will not, not be, be shut. shut. Say father. Father. From today. From today. The gate of wealth. The gate of wealth. Over my life. Over my life. Open. 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 Amen. Fire will kill that evil gate man. Amen. Fire will kill that evil gate man. Amen. Fire burn them. Amen. Ah. See what the word of God is saying? And in verse 2. I will go before you. Now I will go. He said, you will, I will not leave you. Neither what? Forsake Take you. It. Now here, I will go before you. I will make the crooked places straight. And I will break in pieces the gate of brass. And call the bars of iron. How dare them? Oh, ye gay, be ye lifted up, and oh, ye everlasting door. For the King of Glory shall come in. Who is that King of Glory? The Lord, mighty in battle. You get, be ye lifted up. Amen. Hey, yeah, yeah. No one has ever passed there. You will pass there. Amen. Ah, huh? did you hear what I said? Yes, sir. No one has ever made it in that angle. You will make it in Amen. that angle. Amen. I professor. I receive. Where no one has ever gotten to in area of success in the community you come from, Amen. in the family you come from, you break that record. Amen. 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 Break that record. Amen. Say, you are my shared. And my buckler. He said, I will go before you and make the crooked places straight. Yes, in verse 3. Look at the scripture. I will give you the treasures now, of darkness. Now, all is here. This is where I'm going. I will give you the treasures of what? Of the light? Darkness. Of the light? No, sir. Of light? No, sir. Of light? No. Of what? No. Of darkness. I will give you the treasure to give is to take. Mm. And to take is to harvest. <laughs> See, I hear. I hear. See, I hear. I hear. I will give you the platform to harvest the treasures of darkness and the hidden riches of the secret places. The secret places is the kingdoms unknown. Yes. Oh, kingdoms unknown. Uh, somebody hear me here. I hear you, sir. Kingdoms you don't know that they exist. Mm. Yeah, they are in possession of your yeah. possessions. Kingdoms you don't know that they exist. Yet, 
Can I say this to you? Yes, sir. It's a shame, permit me to say it, for someone who do not know God doing better than you. Yes. I will look unto the hill where comes my help. My help comes from the Lord who makes the heavens, 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 and the earth. First heaven, second heaven, where principalities and powers are saying, God said, I am the one who made it. <laughs> so they are, they are ten out there. We are about to give them quick notice. Ah, yeah, yeah. Are you hearing me? A good father leave inheritance for, for his children. children. So what belongs to your father belongs to you. So if the idea is a turn and say Satan, Satan, pack out, pack out. Amen. Understand who you are. Mm. Habi, habi. Mm. Pack out. Now, now. Now, now. Maja, maja. Mm -hmm. Now, now, now. Mm -hmm. give, I, I want you to write something. Write a quick notice on them. In your home, write a quick notice. Yeah. Just write something. Write something. This is a mysterious. Amen. Just use your hand to write something. Yes, sir. You are writing quick notice to them. Mm -hmm. Amen. In that heavens, quick notice. Mm. In your business, quick notice. Ah, in your career, make sure your hand is working. In your career, quick notice. Just write something. You are sending them, in fact, you are giving them between now and seven hours. They must pack their things and what? And go. Enough is a what? It's enough. That you may know that I, the Lord who called you by your name, I am the God of what? Of Israel. If he do not do wondrous things yes. around you, you will not know who he is. Yes. Somebody heard me. Amen. That you might know, you will know me when I'm, when I'm done. That you might know that I, the Lord, who called who you, called you by, by your name, name. I am the God of, of Israel. Israel. As I close here, there are three kingdoms, there are three places you must take advantage of if you will prosper over any kingdom. Amen. Number one, the kingdoms of the water. water. Number one, the kingdom of the earth. Number three, the kingdoms of heavens. Amen. In Genesis chapter 1, verse 28, I will close here. The kingdoms of the water, God carefully made us to be conscious of these kingdoms. He carefully made us to be conscious of this kingdom. The kingdoms of the water, the kingdoms of the earth and the kingdoms of the heavens. Genesis chapter 1 verse 28. Yes, what is the Bible saying? God eh? blessed them yes. and said to them, be fruitful and multiply. Yes. Fill the earth and subdue it. Yes. Have dominion over the fish of the sea. Now have authority over the kingdoms in the sea. Amen. Have dominion over the kingdoms in the what? In the sea. Yes, number two. Over the birds of the air. Over the kingdoms in the heavens. Number three. And over the things living. that creepers upon the earth. Over the kingdoms on the surface of what? Of, of this earth. earth. Amen. Now, if you don't have dominion and subdue them, you can never prosper in any of this. Are you aware there are fishermen who are poor and there are fishermen who are doing well? Yes. Because the ones who are doing well have been able to subdue the kingdoms of the waters. Amen. That is why you see a brother can be doing the same brother, doing the same business with a brother. One is doing well and the other one is not doing well. Now look, look at this. One might have been unconsciously that without knowing, unconsciously subdue the kingdom in that territory. Mm -hmm. It could be as a result of spiritual exercise. It could be as a result of prayer, fasting, sacrifices. Without him knowing that what he has done has given him open hand. Yes, uh, I hear you, sir. Open hand. Mm -hmm. I, now, come. Let's come to a reward. How would you see people who go and throw cow, goat inside the water? Yeah. What are they doing? They are trying to appeal to the kingdoms of the water, uh, but that is yeah. not the way to capture them. Yeah. Now, can I say this to you? Yes, sir. If God have used mouth to create them, you can use mouth to instruct them. Amen. <laughs> Did you hear what I'm saying? Yes, sir. If God used mouth to create them, it was only human being God didn't use mouth to create. That was one the seventh day I have to rest. Because anything that involves flesh labor or physical labor, it kills energy. Mm. It will weaken you on earth. Spirit don't use hand, they use voice. 
Are you hearing me? Yes, sir. Learn to use your voice, especially in a place of prayer. Prayer have no age. Prayer is older than any man on earth yes. now. Jesus started with prayer and ended with what? With prayer. What means Abraham? As I close here. Genesis chapter 14, verse 28. Verse 18 to 24. What made Abraham? Now look at the scripture. Here then close. Melchizedek, yes. king of Salem, brought out bread and wine. He was the priest of God most high. Yes. And he blessed him and said, Blessed be Abraham of God most high. Now, listen. Abraham was recognized as a man who was blessed. Hmm. Now, let's see the secret behind his blessing. I will close here. Possessor of heaven. Possessor of what? Of heaven Heavens and earth. Are what? And, and earth. earth. Hold it up. He was able to dispossess them. He was able to possess them. When you dispossess, you what? You possess. possess. You didn't hear me. When you dispossess any kingdom. Now, what happened? He went after a particular kingdom, dispossessed them because he is a possessor. A man who is a possessor can never be disposed. He happened to be a possessor. If you are a possessor of heavens and earth, you can be dispossessed. Amen. To be dispossessed is to be sucked, mm -hmm. to be empty, Cheated. to be disadvantaged, wow. to be valueless. Abba, oh. Can I say this to somebody? Yes, sir. In the name of Jesus, the authority you lost yes. to the devil, Amen. the makes devil to be in possession of what God created you with, what God bless you with, two things. What God created you with and what God bless you with. Mm. <laughs> Did you hear me? Yes, sir. Two things. What he created you with, with and what you. he blessed you with. Mm -hmm. And the Bible says he blessed them. Mm -hmm. Now, the first blessing God gave to us was the breath he gave to us. Yes. Life never came empty. Yes. Follow my teacher. Close here. What God breathed into you was supreme. Was what? Was supreme. supreme. And that's one thing that God will not allow the devil to just take from you without permission. Mm. And he said to the devil, of all that Job have, you can take, but don't touch what I gave him when I was creating him. Mm. The life. Mm. Are you hearing me? Yes, sir. I close here. You can take everything. That are blessed with. But one thing you will not take was the one I gave him when I was creating him. Abu Shah, today I am mandated. Amen. Everything you lost. Now, arise and take them. Amen. <laughs> As I have I say, arise and take them. Amen. Say, I am taking them. I am taking say, them. Say, I am taking them. I am taking them. Say, 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 I am taking them. 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 I am taking